and it takes about four years to complete your CA. So it's a little difficult course to kind of complete. However, the cost involved is very low. You can finish your entire chart accountancy course in if you're a 12th standard student of commerce and wondering what to pursue next, then this video is for you, wherein we'd be discussing all Indian and global courses along with their course structure, what is their uh, cost, what is the salary expectation, what's the kind of job you can land up to. So please stay tuned till the end to get all your confusion clarified. I'm Megha Bansali, ACCA and the Indian Qualified Child Accountant. So to begin with, I'd be discussing about the Child Accountancy course of India. So the course is divided into three levels, which is your foundation, intermediate and your final, having 16 papers in total. There are two requirements to pass the examination. You need to score 40% in your individual paper and 50% overall, which makes the course very difficult. So if 100 students are entering the CA syllabus, then roughly only 10 to 15 are able to clear their CA examination in the first attempt. And it takes about four years to complete your CA. So it's a little difficult course to kind of complete. However, the cost involved is very low. You can finish your entire chart accountancy course in about two to three lakhs, including your tuition fees, registration, examination fees, all of that. The pay package is definitely brilliant. You can expect 9 to 12 lakhs per annum in India as the starting package. And the typical job profiles that you'll be getting is auditing, accounting and taxation. Moving on to the global course compared to the Indian CA is ACCA. ACCA is also divided into three levels and it has 13 papers. Now, the only way to pass the examination is get 50% in each of the paper and you are cleared. So, it is a lot more easier to complete your ACCA compared to Indian CA. And it has a lot of flexibility. You can just write one paper. You do not have to give the entire group together. So, passing percentage is relatively higher, which is about 40 to 50%. So, if 100 students are starting ACCA, about 40 to 50 of them will get their degree in the very first attempt. The cost involved is somewhere about three to four lakhs is what you can expect. However, the cost uh, can vary a little because it has to be paid in pounds. Now, the pay package that you're going to get in India is going to be about six to nine lakhs per annum is what you can expect at the beginning. However, if you're going to go abroad, then the pay package can be 15 to 20 lakhs in the starting. And it's a global course. It's recognized in 180 countries. So if you're looking to step outside India, then definitely this is a very good course in accounting and finance. The job profiles are pretty similar to Indian CA, which is auditing, accounting and taxation. Now moving to the next course, which is CMA. So it is typically a cost management, wherein you're going to be learning about how to cost analysis of a manufacturing company and typically it's mandatory for manufacturing companies to have a CMA. So this is a good opportunity out there. The course is again divided into three different levels. You can finish the course in about two lakhs and uh, the pay package however is relatively lower which is about five to six lakhs is what you can expect in the beginning. Now comparing a global course of Indian CMA is the US based CMA. So the US CMA is again a lot more simpler to finish. It has just two levels. So you have to just write two papers and you're done with your CMA. Now this is relevant only if you want to go to US, you want to work there. It is not so uh, acceptable in India because again, we have an Indian version. So uh, that would be preferred here. However, global opportunities are always there for US CMA. The pass percentage is higher, which is about 50%. Cost involved is again about 1 to 2 lakhs is what you will incur because they're just two levels and uh, you complete your CMA. Now the pay package that you can expect in India would be about 5 lakhs per annum. Uh, the typical profiles that you will be getting as a CMA in India or if you do a US CMA would be in a manufacturing industry. Uh, would be analyzing cost of a particular product, cost of a particular service line. Uh, very detailed analysis is what would be uh, done by a CMA. Now, there's another popular course in India is the company secretary course, 
which is uh, basically having three different levels. Now the passing percentage is about 25 percentage, so relatively higher. Uh, the job profile that you would be getting as a CS is doing a company's filing. Now all companies have a mandatory filing to be done with the uh, registrar of company, which is done by a CS. So the demand is huge. However, the pay package is relatively lowered. It is about uh, five to six lakhs per annum is what you can expect as your starting salary. So what I have covered are your professional courses, which you can start immediately after your 12th standard. There are definitely a lot more courses. However, those are to be done after your graduation, like your CFA, you have your MBA, you have your CPA. So those are your postgraduate course, which I'm not covering right now. And yes, just a BCom is not going to help you, not going to land up anywhere. So it is important to add a professional degree to yourself. So Indian CA, ACCA, CMA, US CMA, CS, these are your good options if you are in your commerce field. If you require a detailed guidance on these courses, require a career counseling session, then definitely you can reach out to me. Details have been given here. I'd be very happy to help each one of you out there. Please do subscribe to my channel, like my video, share it with uh, someone who is in 12th standard, requires clarity on what they should be pursuing. And please do comment below on how you found this video. And if you require any kind of video to be made in future, you can drop in a comment below. We'll definitely make that content. Hope you found this video informative and I'll be back with more such information. Till then, take care.